Hello, this is Gail from Burger Sewing and Vacuum and welcome to another foot fetish. And today I'm going to talk about the border guide foot. And this is a nice foot. You notice that it has some guides on it. So if I had one row of stitching, I can line it up with one of these guides so I don't have to put marks all over my fabric. So if I were to put this, and I'm going to try and keep this lined up right along the edge of here. So now I'm going to do my next row of stitching and I'm going to pull it back just a wee bit because it also gives me markings for where my needle's at as well as where the center is. So now if I were to sew my next row, just trying to keep it lined up, even though this is going a little bit side to side, it's still, I'm still just keeping my eye right there and making sure that it's staying pretty close. I know the camera's at an angle, so it doesn't look quite the same as what I'm seeing. But hopefully I will keep it all lined up nice and straight and I can have it lined up on either side of that line. And I'm sewing on the aerial today. And we'll see how this looks. Also a little bit longer. I will tell it to stop after it's done with this particular stitch. you can see that I kept it nice in line. Now let's try and find a stitch that's maybe not quite so wide. Um, I'll just do this. No. Delete those. I should have figured out what stitches. I could even go on this side. So if I went on this side, let's put this down, and I could line it up. Now this time I'm going to line it up. Like I said, the camera you can't see, but I'm lining it up right along here. Now this one, so now I can go a little bit faster because I'm going to keep it lined up right along the edge of that original stitching. So you only need to put the line for one row of stitching and after that you can just use it as your guide for all your other ones. So here you go and you can see that now since the first one went a little crooked, they're all going to go crooked. But I can decide where I want it. I could have even put it you know, right up against the edge of the foot. I could have used this as a guide, this as a guide, the edge of the foot as a guide, right here as a guide. And now you can go and do all kinds of rows of stitching without having to mark every single row. So until next time, have fun sewing with your feet.